Alright everyone, welcome back to the Tiger Times. We have a couple announcements before getting on with the rest of this. First off, there's a Bells football game. It's going to be at Bells tonight. Make sure to show your spirit. Also, Wired is going to be hosting the Special Olympics this Wednesday. And they're going to be pulling a couple of juniors and seniors to help. You'll figure out who soon. Also, next Thursday, Maylee is running for state. So if you see her in the halls, wish her luck and tell her a great job because she is the first woman in Wyatt history to make it to state for cross country. And also, fishing is going to be ending soon. And then on Friday, the girls volleyball has a tiebreaker at Bells against Bonham at 4.30. So make sure to show up and cheer them on. Hopefully we get it to playoffs. Also, beta induction is on Monday, so remember that for your beta students. And then the theater is having a production for Alice and it's based off of Alice in the Wonderland. It's gonna be November 6th at 7 p.m. in the White Wright Commons. Thank you. Hi, my name is Esmeralda Lozano. I'm in Seniors Crawford, uh, fifth period, Spanish two. And today, since Halloween's coming up, I wanna talk about how do you say Halloween in Spanish, which is Vidas Brujas or Happy Halloween, whichever you wanna say. But since Dia de los Muertos is coming up as well, you can also say Feliz de los Muertos, which is next Tuesday as well. Whichever you want to do, um, you can say Happy Halloween in English or Feliz de los Brujas, whichever you feel comfortable with. Hi, I'm Jacob, and this is Sydney. We're from Miss Lawson's ASL2 class, and we're going to sign Day of the Dead. Hi, I'm Deegan, this is Chalk, and we're in Miss Lawson's ASL2 class, and today we're going to be signing Happy Halloween for you guys. Yeah. Hi, I'm Sabrina. I'm here with Ryan and Hayden, and I'm going to be teaching them some basic color guard moves. So, to start, we're just going to do a drop spin. So, they all know what that looks like. It's just this. Super simple, okay? Okay. You have to be in the video game. <laughs> in the video. Okay, so back up. You have to space out. All right, so to start, just bring your right arm out in front of you like that, and you're gonna take it and you're gonna turn it upside down. Yep, now you're gonna take your left hand, turn it upside down as well, and grab underneath your right hand. And then turn it back upward. That, that's it, so now you just keep turning it like that. And that's it. Oh, no, hang on. Whatever. <laughs> I've never done this before. <laughs> That's it, good, oh. <laughs> okay, uh, the next thing I'm gonna teach them is just a basic toss, so you just. That's, not basic. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most basic toss, okay? So you're gonna take it, you're gonna hold over, over, which just means your hands are like this. Yep, and you're gonna take it like this, and you're gonna Throw your right arm up in the air like this, and you're gonna push down with your left hand on the into the pole. And then you have to catch it. But that would have been really good if you caught it. <laughs> I, I cannot see. <laughs> Don't throw it away show. from you. Yeah, Just throw it directly up. Don't throw it in front of you. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> that was closer. Kyle, what's the fun fact for the day? Did you know that Nightmare on Elm Street got its name from the JFK assassination? Now you do. <laughs> that's, that's mean. <laughs>